squads in here walking around the party of cross between the zombie and pop and it's a new army to bring me in which is probably the same reason I wrestle with mania shades in this bitch I'm posse to consider it to cost me a costly mistake if they sleep in army to close that I get insomnia ADHD all right coming up next it's a middleweight matchup between Paolo Costa and George Rush St. Pierre UFC event. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed yeah. by this jump. Oh, effective strike there by Costa. All right, early round one here. Big reach advantage, DC. We'll see if he can employ that patented jab. Yes, he has to maintain distance. He's the taller guy. So every time his opponent tries to enter, he's going to have to take something on the way inside. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, massive kick lands flush. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by George St. Pierre. Oh, man, hate to be hit with one of those knees to the body. Way to hide that leg kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, you can hear the thwack from here as he lands another leg kick in DC. Now we're seeing visible damage as that leg starts to redden up. And now you start to see the damage. And now you start to see the limping of the opponent. Watch as he gets kicked in the leg, he's turning away. He can't even get any pressure on his front leg anymore. He is beat up. That leg has been tenderized by this young man. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Overhand right, swing and a miss. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Ooh, what a punch. And they separate. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Nice one, two there. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, nice punch there by Costa. Punch coming, it's blocked. Now connects with a right. Straight right hand now, just misses. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Not only will this affect his ability to stand, but he can't really set down on his punches and he won't generate the power that he normally generates because he can't really get heavy on his leg. GSP gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, good opportunity to do damage here. He's got that tight clinch. Big knee there. Oh, straight right. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press it. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! Man. Oh, he might be out. Different things right now. And 
you hear the crowd react every time they come together because they understand the power that these guys are striking with. Just missed with the left there. Costa gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Oh! He needs to start looking at the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Oh, straight right. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Gentlemen, it clean. Look at him drive his shit into his opponent's body with that body kick. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other, agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed. You ready to fight? You ready? Round two is on the way. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. All right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Look at how he turns his hips into that leg kick. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Cost as tough as it gets, but how about the size of that bruise starting to form on his right side? He's looking for that left hand, not there. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Nice leg kick land. St. Pierre gets caught by that straight punch. Beautifully landed by the opposition. Oh, he's hurt. He's got him hurt here. Oh, big left. Whiffs on that offering. Stuff the takedown, no problem. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Operating inside the closed guard now. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes in your opponent. Just over two minutes to go. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Good work from the top here by Costa. Arch, a good ground and pound by him here, certainly staying busy, and not just busy, but effective. You can just throw punches to keep the referee off you. This guy is throwing punches to be effective, to throw damaging strikes. He's doing a fantastic job. St. Pierre's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Costa going to work here from guard. Nice combination there. Everything he throws is with fight ending intentions. Oh, 
Wow, nice combination of strikes here from the top, standing over his opponent, not unlike Muhammad Ali over Sonny Liston. Oh, that is a good reference. If you're standing and your opponent's on the ground, you're doing really good work. All right, hammer fist here by Costa. Man, this is some serious ground in town here, DC. He's not just staying busy for the sake of staying busy. These strikes are doing damage. Oh, yeah, no pity path to this guy. This guy's trying to land, and he's trying to land effective strike. St. Pierre's going for the sub here. He's gonna tag armbar here. Oh, he picks him up and slams him down. Big explosive slam to lift him and slam him on that armbar. Go right into side control. Now let's see what he does, right? Sometimes when you do that, the choke or the yes. submission can get tighter, but he was able to evade it there. Yes. All right, we'll see how he chooses to defend here. Nice hammer fist. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You see, he was nearly caught in a submission there right at the end of the round, saved by the bell. So back to the stool, mentally probably not in a great place here. We'll see if he can recover and get himself back into this fight. All right, now we... Third round underway. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Big leg kick lands. St. Pierre gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. All right, so the commitment to the takedown pays off. After several failed attempts, he finally gets his first takedown. Now let's see what he can do with it. Slicing and dicing. Looking good with these elbows tonight, Jim. He looks like a Michelin star chef trying to nice. slice and dice in the kitchen the way he's tearing his opponent up. Lands the ground and pound strike. He's putting him in exactly the positions he needs to be in right now. He's able to relax here. And he understands, being a veteran of so many fights, that as long as he's on top, he's winning. He feels like he's winning here. Look at that leg. St. Pierre gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Head kick there blocked by GSP. Costa gets caught with that punch. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in <laughs> Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. <laughs> Misses with that punch. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. And now he lands a combination. Oh. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bear's watching. That's gonna hurt this opponent. Just missing on the uppercut there. Costa gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot. That's income. Straight right hand, no good. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. All right, so he lands another punch there, and he smells blood in the water, going right back at that cut. Absolutely. The opponent has a lot of scar tissue around the eyes. He was able to cut it open, and now he's just touching it over and over again. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Oh, a nice job. Well, just like he drew it up with us on Thursday, catches the kick, counters beautifully with the takedown. He did a great job countering 
with that nice takedown. Great fight IQ, seeing that kick coming and turning it into his offense. Just misses there with the left. Check that kick as well. Over and over, he landed a big body kick. And the takedown attempt, but he does not land it. Oh! Oh, big knee! Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up. Oh, man, look at that. Pink turn, perfect. Got to the leg, got to his position, got another beautiful takedown. I love watching this guy move on the ground. Another nice transition there. Such a high-level grappler. You don't see that very often. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh! Oh! Like that left hand. Seconds winding down in round three. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh! What a fight so far. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see. Listen up. You've been here before, all right? You ready to fight? Ready. Let's go. Oh, nice job to get the guard up there as the strike is blocked by Costa. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press this. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! Huge right hand! the takedown, no problem. <laughs> Barely missed on an uppercut right here on the inside. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice. Look at the angle of that nice body. Nice one through there. Man. He's got him hurt here. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice body. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Starting to see the damage now bleeding from his cheek. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. <laughs> oh! Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Cutting them down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big kick land. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Liver kick. Nice straight punch. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, 
Oh, he gets up. The question is for how long? You got to check these low leg kicks. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. There's no tell on that leg kick. Under two minutes to go in the round. Oh, and he caught the kick. Try to establish that jab. Big leg kick lands. Offensive fight. Nice job to block the shot there. Takedown defense holds up. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. There's all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is going to hurt something fierce tomorrow. All right, sir, good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking. He's rolling. He's slipping. He's doing a great job. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Nice punch land over the top. Oh, man! It's such a fast leg kick. Caught that kick there. Visibly limping here. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Costa. All right, boy, Ty Clinch. A lot of elbows and knees could be coming from here. We'll see how he chooses to attack. Yeah, it's a very dangerous position, but an advantageous one for the offensive fighter. Watch for his offensive guy to try to break this speed. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Fifth and final round. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Oh, and he caught the kick. Head kick partially blocked. Oh, nice move to the body. Just what he needed there. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. to land the kick to the body there by Costa. Whoa! Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He's mixing up his target. He's throwing kicks. He's throwing punches. How about that shit? Those are big strikes. Bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Oh, we'll see if he postures up and can get some of his ground strikes going here. St. Pierre gets caught by the elbow there. You know he's tough, but you just don't want to absorb too many more of those. All right, so pretty good damage here with the ground and pound. Nothing superficial about these strikes. They are intending to hunt. Oh, yeah, he's landing very accurately, and he's landing to get damage off. Elbow to the head there by Costa. 
Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Oh, back to the well with that elbow. That one landed well. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by George St. Pierre. Nice job keeping busy fighting off of his back. St. Pierre's back in half goal. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Man, doesn't take much for the redness to start. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Close guard. Oh, well placed with the hammer fist there by Costa. Man, this is some serious ground and pound. He's trying to put this dude's head, like, through the canvas. He's one of the better ground and pound fighters we have in the entire UFC, and you're seeing why. Two minutes now to go in this one. Ooh, blocks the shot. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of Better him than me. Andy lands the knee to the body now. Oh! Get right here. Oh, huge block. Watching this one back with Bruce Buffer has the official decision. <laughs> 